हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे टॉपिक इज क्वालिटी ऑफ कन्फर्मेंस सो बेस्ड ऑन द क्वालिटी लेवल एंड आइडियल डिजाइन विल बी मेड सो क्वालिटी ऑफ कन्फर्मेंस डील्स विद वेदर द प्रोडक्ट प्रोड्यूस्ड कन्फर्म्स टू द स्पेसिफिकेशंस और नॉट so based on the quality level which we have already discussed in the design of quality so quality level will be decided based on the customers needs and an ideal design will be made that is nothing but quality of design now quality of conformance deals with whether the product which we are producing is conforming to the specifications or not so when we design when this ideal design is is made there will be specifications for this ideal design what are those specifications those specifications are type of material used the processes followed dimensions which are decided in the quality of design so now let us see few examples for quality of conformance so for example if we consider a product conformance of quality of a product means that if the tires are not conforming to the specifications they will wobble example let us take a product consider tires are not conforming to quality or specifications then they will wobble so this is one example now example for conformance of quality for a service not a product so if a hotel room is not clean when the guests check in then the hotel is not functioning according to the specifications of its design so this is about a service not a product so for achieving quality of conformance there are number of factors which have to be considered i will simply write it factors affecting the quality of conformance the first one is design of production process so the production process must be according to the product design if it is distinct from the product design if the process is not meeting the specification then we cannot reach quality of conformance the next one is the performance level of machinery if the performance level of the machinery is not high then we cannot reach quality of conformance then the equipments and technology which is being used so equipment and technology also play a important role in achieving the quality of conformance if we are not using updated equipment and technology then the quality of conformance will not be able to achieve then the materials used the material used must be according to the design of quality or according to the specifications which have been mentioned in the design if they are other than those materials then quality of conformance is not reached training and supervision of employees so if the employees who are working on that particular process they are not trained or there is no supervision 
then quality of conformance is difficult to be reached. The last one is the degree to which statistical control techniques are used. So all these is possible only when these factors that is the design of production process, performance level of machinery, equipment and technology, material used, training and supervision of the employees and the degree to which these statistical control techniques are used, they must all be within the specifications. So they must reach the or they must meet the specifications. If they fail to meet the specification, then we cannot achieve the quality of conformance or the specifications are not met. That is nothing but it has not met the quality of conformance. So design specifications are not met in the following conditions. So when these design specifications are not met, the first issue will be when the equipment fails or is malfunctioned. The next cause is when employees make mistakes. The third cause for not meeting the specification is when the materials and the parts are defective. The last one is when the supervision is lagged when there is lack of supervision. An important consideration from the customer's perspective of product quality is product or service price. So for the customer to have product quality, they also consider the price of the product or the price of the service. So here the customer sees the product quality and the price also. But for the producer, an important consideration is achieving quality of conformance at an acceptable price. So producer wants a good quality or high quality product along with the acceptable cost. So we can say that Product cost is also an important design specification. So the quality characteristic including in the product design should be balanced according to the, against the production cost. So while designing the product we have to consider the production cost and its cost when it reaches to the market also. So we approach quality from two perspectives that is the customers and the producers. So these two perspectives that is the customers and the producers perspective are dependent on each other. So the product design is customer motivated yet it cannot be achieved without the coordination and the participation of the production process. So the design which is made, it is made according to the customer's expectation. Even then it cannot be achieved without the cooperation of this production or producer's help. So here what I mean to say is both the customer and the producer, both their perspectives are very important to achieve the quality which is much desired by the customers. When the product is designed without considering how it will be produced then it may be impossible for the production process to meet the design specification or it may become so costly that the product or service may be priced very very high. So if we don't design it or if we don't give design specification then the cost of the product will become very high because the production people will not know how to manufacture the product. So here we can see from this figure that the meaning of quality or to reach the quality both these producers perspective and the customer 
perspective are very very important so the producer works hard to reach the quality of conformance that is to conform to the specification within a limited cost and here quality of design this is the customer's perspective so what kind of quality they need in the product or the service and what are the characteristics of the product they want and the last one but the most important one is the price of the product here in producers perspective they see that the specifications are met within a advisable or within a acceptable cost but here these customers they want high quality but within a very less cost and the final destination they both want to meet is a fitness for customers to use it so the product which or the service which is being designed they want it to be fit for use so here from the figure the meaning of quality at last reaches to the fitness for customers use so this is all about the quality of conformance i hope you have understood the topic thank you